I didn't expect a rank one, by, uh, but I expected a good rank. And after NEET, I thought that I will get some good clinical seat, but I didn't. <laughs> Uh, in Jipma, out of 250, I attempted two times. AIMS, I attempted some 195 questions. And about Jipmer, the Jipmer is very tough. It is very tough exam this time. So in 250, I attempted some 214 questions. Neat, I attempted 300 questions. And for biochemistry, I read Rebecca Mann's book. And for microbiology, I read Aburva Shastri, Survey of Microbiology. Then for SPM, Vivek Jain, Pathopharmax, Parshagupta, um, Surgery, Pradesh Singh, Medicine, Mudit Kanna. And all other subjects, I followed uh, Ravinda Hora. Medicine, I used Mudit Kanna, Surgery, Ashish Gupta. Short subject, Ravinda Hora. SPM, Vivek Jain, uh, Patho and Pharma, Parshagupta. So first I started off with the theory, then I did MCQs. But in within a time limit, so if I was not able to finish, then I skip the less important things. Motivation to read a part, I wanted Jack medicine, so I was really for a long mass. I want to get my favorite subject in my favorite college. <laughs> and I want to do general medicine in Caricat Medical College from UG days onwards. So I started with my dance class notes. Then I started uh, with individual books, MCQ guides I use. So I don't use any previous textbook. I use that Aravinda Rora that MCQ books, the theory part first I read, then I work out the MCQs. If I if I'm wrong, then then I will read the explanation. Each subject I started my uh, test series. Then I started my uh, revision in October, almost twice three times. My suggestion is that you have to start preparing at least 8 months. You need at least 8 months of preparation for tracking the PG. What I have done is, first I bought uh, some gate for almost all subjects. Anatomy, physiology, biochemistry, everything I bought one gate. Then what I did is, I read the theory part. For the first 4 months, uh, I um, completed the theory parts of all subjects. Just reading the theory parts, not the MCQ and all. Just read the theory. After reading theory, you will definitely forget what you have <laughs> read, but that doesn't matter. You have to uh, revise that. For so first first four months you read that. Then for the next three months, I again revise that what I have uh, read in the last four months. And during that time, I did some MCQ, few MCQ from there. So there are two, uh, two revision. Then after that. Again also I read so in the MCQ book there won't be many many long theory parts. For every chapter there will be only one or two pages. So you can easily revise. If you if you are reading some textbook, it will be very long, you will lose time. I, I think it's better to read the theory part only. Really. And during third revision, um, you have to concentrate on MCQ. Not reading every MCQ and searching for the answer. Just go through the MCQ. If you have some good questions. Or some tough questions, tougher the answer. I have done my entrance coaching from Trishu, and uh, um, I think the classes helped me better to understand what, which topic I have to concentrate. There are lot of some 19 subjects and lot of topics, so you can't read everything in that eight months. So uh, I concentrated on the topics that are taken in the class. So attending a class, I think it will be helpful. I started in uh, February, so the exam was in December, so almost one year. Uh, after April, I started my intense preparation, going more than 12 hours a day. There is no specific time that you have to read this much hours during some 14 hours, 12 hours, you can say like that. Um, so in every day, you have to read the maximum time you could, you have to be dedicated like that. First go with theory concept, then start working MCQ, not go for MCQ directly. Be sincere to your work. That's all. All the best.